All right, Robert, George, here's your update. The deck is done. Over here I had to uh, just sister it because I didn't want to mess with all this supporting triangles here. They're all solid, so I just did lag, uh, lag bolts straight into there. Deck's all done. It's ready for caulking on the joints, painting in the spring. In here, kitchen's been stripped. Pretty much, pretty much. We need to check hot water tank. Toby's on it, see how old it is while we're at it. Uh, stupid plumbing, copper to pex to copper, don't need it. <clears throat> There's a check here, which I'm hoping I can eliminate so we can have a flat drip rock wall to put up the IKEA. Over here, I highly recommend you get an electrician in. This ground wire belongs to this 220 wire which I think is connected to either the heater or the hot water tank. Either either way it's not grounded and it's stripped out here. That's not how you do it. It's you know this is the stove and that's not how you wire a stove. And this has been frayed so you know what since all these wires come from down below I think we could just trench out a center portion and pass them back there and have a nice clean installation. But I highly recommend you get the electrician in here for that. Old wires, I don't really want to mess with those. I'd like to see them go behind the wall if possible. Down here, so you know, there's a toilet. Lovely, isn't it? Yeah. So I stripped out the toilet because I wanted to see what was back here. It's a good thing I did. There's a valve here. There's a plastic compression valve back here. This whole ABS pipe was for the vanity over here and the water supply. What I recommend is we move the vanity over here next to the wall of the shower and then we can remove this here and have the toilet over here facing that way. The baseboard heater can go on this wall, so you'll have this much more space. And I can back this up a little bit. I just need to find out if you have still more of this, uh, I guess it's 8x8 white tile. Because we'll need a little bit to redo in there. But I think that's worth it doing. It's a little change, but uh, vanity here. Toilet next to it. Eliminate all this hutchka pachka. <laughs> Michigan, whatever, and a brand new heater over here, so it'll be better. Let me know what you think.